French, they take and never give anything back, ever. Mm -hmm. Still this day, they've been in places three, four hundred years, and that place in, in areas in Africa has never developed not one inch. Um, you've declared that the future is in Africa, and I think the world knows that, which is why China's there and yep. other nations haven't given up their relationships, right? Because most of 100%. France's revenue still comes from Africa. 90% uh, of France's right. revenue comes from People Africa. People say that France is technically a broke nation, and which is why they don't come off the, the relationships, the very colonial still relationships they have with many nations in Africa. 100%. Keep them broke. France is rich, yep. et cetera, et cetera. Yep. Um, how does that get changed it's a generational change that needs to happen mind state uh, it's like it's we just have to educate i think in africa is the fact that the older generation has already been accustomed to being under the french you know umbrella to an extent or English especially or in dutch you know, in, in anglo you know yeah like in in, in in francophone that's like the french got a solid iron fist around that Anglophone, which is more South Africa, which is now all, as you can see, is all changing. Anglophone countries are slowly changing. The other countries are still trying to still continue to, they, they got the independence, but not quite. That's why they're constantly at war. Because they don't they, have financial They're trying to stay free. Exactly. And then they're blocked out of all the big, you know, opportunities because of the fact that they're completely free and not teamed up with any European or outside, you know, pretty much connected connections. You know what I mean? So, um, Africa is just, it's, it's a different type of, uh, you could say value there because Africa pretty much built the universe that's with right. all their natural resources. Even everything that's happening here and all the, the, the newest innovations is all done through resources and the minerals. Tech, the Colton in exactly, the Exactly, from, from which Africa. Which makes your phones and all that. 100%. So the value is there. Unfortunately, the people, we just uneducated to what that value is. And then the leaders are so uneducated to what that value is. They just practically give it away, not knowing what they're giving away. So... When you look at the Congo, Congo is because of what it does for digital and cell phones and stuff like that. Their resources, like all these cell phone things that you're getting, you know, you know it's all built from the ground in Congo. And, you know, when you look at uh, Guinea, Conakry, those areas, like this, is, the mining over there is just ridiculous. Like, all latest technology and everything moving towards the future is all minerals coming out the ground in Africa. So when you look at value, there's abundance of value. It's not even a question of <laughs> all these multi-billion, trillion-dollar companies are all being fed through resources in Africa. We have it. We just don't... It it's all goes back to education again. And then the older generation, just the leaders don't know exactly what they have, and that's, and that's why they're just giving it away.